Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this short video, I would like to explain to you how to add a Yammer feed into a SharePoint page. Uh, Yammer is, of course, your company's social network. Uh, it's a separate application that is part of your uh, Office 365 subscription. All right, here it is. And of course, in my case, I have you know different groups, different communities um, in Yammer uh, for the gr different groups of users. Um, but one of the tricks I personally like is the ability to add Yammer feed to a SharePoint page. All right, if your users uh, will navigate to a SharePoint page because of documents and uh, other types of announcements and, and information and custom lists, uh, a great way to spice up that page would be to add a Yammer uh, feed. Uh, let me explain to you how to do that. It's uh, pretty straightforward. Uh, you just click the navigate to the page where you want to embed those conversations, click edit. And in the section where you want to add the Yammer feed, just go ahead and add a Yammer web part. There is a Yammer web part that we have available called Conversations. All right, and once you add it, you, there are several different choices on how you want to present the information. You can uh, specify the particular community, all right, the particular community that you have, and just surface that up. Uh, you can also, um, you know, uh, surface up specific topic. Uh, information specific to the user. Uh, home feed allows you to pretty much replicate uh, all right on the page what you see on the home feed kind of on this main page, main Yammer page as well, all right? Uh, now, I personally, in this particular case, I guess as an example, let's um, uh, embed a community that probably would make sense, uh, all right? We want to embed a particular group of uh, you know particular conversation, particular community conversation. So I'm choosing the community dropdown choice. And uh, this is where we need to select a particular community. Uh, the one I want is uh, this one. All right, uh, board members, here we go. You can specify how many you know conversations per page you're going to show. Uh, let's stay with the default setting. And that's it, you just need to hit publish. And essentially, you have Yammer now embedded into a SharePoint page. And uh, what I specifically like about this is that you don't need to leave the page to hold conversations in Yammer. I mean, first of all, they do show up over here. You can like, you can uh, comment on things right from within Yammer. If you have a new you know, question, uh, you can uh, post it right, um, right from the SharePoint page, all right? Um, uh, and just to, to give an example, here we go, perfect. And you can post it. And essentially, I didn't even need to go to a separate application. I was already on the SharePoint page, and users can pretty much uh, access those, obviously, conversations. Well, on the SharePoint page, on Yammer or mobile app, uh, wherever they prefer. They, and again, they can like and comment um, and, and comment as necessary. So it's a great way to spice up the, um, the sh your SharePoint site, your SharePoint page. Uh, and make it a little bit more social. And that's pretty much all I wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.